And welcome back. We're beginning our 11:30 half hour with a sweet reunion taking place. It really should take place any minute now. Yeah, we're all waiting. It's between a local <laughs> soldier and his four-legged friend. He's a Florida National Guardsman, and he adopted a dog while overseas in Iraq. It's been several months since they've seen each other. Until now, Box 13's Josh Cassio live near Tampa International Airport tonight. And uh, any sign yet of the dog and them getting together? Are we still waiting? Yeah, we are this close. We're just minutes away. We're hearing the dog has touched down. It's in transit right now. Uh, to the cargo center here, so we're just minutes away from that emotional, very exciting reunion. And you know, when you think about it, this guy is a medevac helicopter in Iraq, so he's saving lives every day from the front lines, and really that's what he's doing with this dog. It's about a one-year-old shepherd mix. Nick Prashalski says one day back in November, the feral dog comes up to him at the base and instantly befriends him and his crewmates. They fed it, they built it a kennel in the hangar, and next thing you know, she basically becomes part of the team. They would name the dog Aries. She became a huge morale booster. Tonight, Nick and Aries, they're going to be reunion, uh, reunited again in just mere moments as he adopts her and brings her to a place that is so much farther away from a war zone. She can just be, you know, a happy go lucky dog. Everybody I talk to, my fellow, uh, my fellow members in the military, were like, you need to bring that dog home. And I, I made it happen. I'm excited for her reactions of seeing nothing but desert to having a yard of grass and trees, being able to run after squirrels. Is that right there? Now, this was made possible thanks to the SPCA International. They helped bring Aries home. This should be the best time of her life. If we come, come back out uh, live here, in fact, there she is in that kennel. So oh my uh, the gosh. reunion is just about to happen. Oh, there wait. she is oh, right we there. Gotta, oh, look, she's in the kennel. OK, can we stay with this shot for just a minute? Nick is uh, <laughs> in his car. Let's see if I can wave him over here. Yeah, get him out of that car. Oh, comes. my gosh. Look at this. And, you know, how many hours has this play? I mean, how's this taken for this dog to get here, too, Josh? I mean, that's a long way from Rock. Yeah, they flew to uh, New York last night and then New York here about three hours plus a few delays. Look at the smile on that face there. <laughs> oh, look at this. She's ready to get out, isn't I she? I know. You know she's ready to get out of that kennel. That's, that's quite a trip uh, for any dog to take, much less one... Um, who was living on its own in the desert like she was. Looks like they got a little bit of paperwork All right, there. Nick, how are you feeling right now? I'm pretty nervous, <laughs> pretty excited. Here she comes. I'm happy. Hey. Hi. Hi. Come here. Hi. Come here. Hi. Yeah. Look at that. Clearly knows Nick. Hi. Wow, she remembers. Hi. <laughs> oh, Hi. my. Yeah. You're a lot bigger. Here she is. <laughs> Come here. Go wind up. Oh, hear, hear that? You I guys can, hear that? I can hear her whining. Um, oh, my gosh. <laughs> what is this like for you right now? I, I, I can't even put it in words. Yeah. I really can't. Uh, you know, when she came up to us and, you know, I didn't think I was going to get her home. And they made it possible. Everybody made it possible. And it's just unbelievable. It really is. She looks so sweet. Wow. <laughs> Hi. Oh, she's a good girl, though. Oh, yeah. All right. And, and even kisses now. <laughs> hey, yep. She remembers. That was my ma big nervous thing that she wouldn't remember, but she obviously does. Well, so, congratulations. Thank, yeah, you. Thank you. This is fantastic. <laughs> How's that, guys? Hey. For uh, a late night, but wow. What a moment, huh? That's the best live TV I've seen in a long time, Josh, I have to say. And, you know, <laughs> it, it, you know, you think about that. What a lucky dog. But I imagine that that relationship, when you're so far away from home and out in the desert in a war zone like that, you know, it's got to mean yeah. something really special. So to, to, for them to be reunited yeah. is just the best. She has quite a life ahead, for sure. <laughs> yes, she does. We'll be checking back. Thanks and so much, too. Josh Cassio, for bringing that to us tonight.